Hello to bunch of comic book readers and the kids out there. I'm Mike from Comic Frontline, and welcome to my Kitty Corner review of a 12-part series that I'll be doing for Comic Frontline. And this is a comic from Archie Comics. This is the Worlds Unite, part 1 of 12, starting off with Sonic Universe, issue number 76. Um, apparently, uh, the title doesn't show here, because what you see here is uh, 1 of 12 of a variant poster that both me and my brother are going to be collecting and basically at the uh, beginning to end it's going to look like this in the end so in every world unite we'll be getting the varying covers and this will be covering Sonic Universe, Sonic Boom, Sonic the Hedgehog and Mega Man and uh, it will be looking like this in the end so Throughout the world tonight, uh, we, there won't be covers, but I'll be sure the title is correct. So this is Sonic Universe, issue number 76. So without further ado, let's get into this. We have Worlds Collide, now we're going into Worlds Unite, where both Sonic and Mega Man will be teaming up once again. So it starts off with Mega Man X going up against uh, Sigma, which is the living digital virus who is making a threat to uh, Mega Man's world and he's going to make that threat by teaming up with Dr. Eggman. Meanwhile in Sonic's universe we see him going to get Knuckles' Master Emerald shards from what we've seen in the Sonic the Hedgehog comic books and uh, here's uh, Mega Man's world by the way the artwork's fantastically drawn uh, that appears in this book and I get more of an understanding of what's going on in Mega Man because like I said issue zero after the worlds collide I've been picking up Mega Man and uh, was really enjoying it so uh, if it wasn't for worlds collide I would not be reading Mega Man so uh, just want to throw that out there and he's just going on his adventure uh, elsewhere now we have Meg um, Dr. Eggman with the Deadly Six who appear in this comic book and um, it's just Eggman talking about uh, Sigma One who's actually the Maverick Overlord Reborn that goes to meet up with Dr. Eggman and um, you know he's just saying about how his uh, designs are advanced and everything and he sends in Dr. Wily to team up with Dr. Eggman and to be honest I thought that Dr. Eggman didn't want to team up with Dr. Wily after Worlds Collide and it just seems like they never really met each other and they have unless their memories got erased or something so Dr. Eggman's just saying you know let's just team up together because I have a plan where we can uh, pull off and make chumps out of Sigma, Sonic, and Mega Man and we all know that that's probably not going to turn out that way in the end because you know, all that stuff happens. So, uh, yeah, uh, Sigma had uh, something up his sleeve. So, uh, Dr. Eggman and Dr. Wally are going to have to think uh, very much uh, of a plan to get out Sigma because Sigma's one step ahead of both of them, including the uh, Deadly Six. And he sends out the Deadly Six to kidnap both Sonic the Hedgehog and also Mega Man. And as they're brought back to the lab, both Dr. Eggman and Dr. Wally have a plan of, uh, well, let's just say it turned out to be like this. And we're not going to know until next issue because it's to be continued. So uh, Sonic and Mega Man at the mercy of the unified villains. You can catch their struggle for freedom against the Armored Deadly Six in Mega Man World Unite Battles Number One and Sonic World Unite Battles Number One on sale next month. So I'll be getting those two, and uh, hopefully do a kitty corner view of that. But in the meantime, the adventure continues next time in Sonic Boom issue number eight. And there's a off panel that I read, which I found very funny. And the preview cover of the next issue, Sonic Universe number 77, this is part 5 of 12 of the World Tonight um, next time in Sonic Universe. So this was a really good um, first issue, 
and uh, really interesting. I give this a mix between a 4.5 to 5. No, you know what? Actually, no. I give this a 5 out of 5 rating. This was a really great starting point to the World Unite comic book. Really excellent read and some for the kids to read, actually. So, uh, definitely something to pick up because this book, if Worlds Collide did awesome, I'm really having high hopes that Worlds Unite will bring the same thing as it did for Worlds Collide. And with that, everybody, that's my Kitty Corner view of Sonic Universe, issue number 76. Before I go, don't forget to check out Comic Play, Comic Frontline, and Frontline Gaming Zone. Together, we know the source for comic and game related news, reviews, and a whole bunch more. Subscribe to Comic Frontline today for more videos to come. And comment below if you've read this book, your thoughts, and any predictions you have about this book, please feel free to leave your comments. I'll be more than happy to answer them as soon as I can. So to all the kids and true comic agrees out there, until next time, I'm Mike from Comic Frontline saying take care, keep watching. Later, everybody.